This is code.org. Let's see what we're doing. Loops with Harvester. Try one more on your own. Ooh, notice it's an L. I'm going to do what I always do. I'm just going to start throwing down some code. So I think we need to go west and pick. But how many times? And now I'm even going to skip the picking. I know I need corn. I'm just trying to figure out and then maybe sell. Look, I'm already at seven blocks, so we're definitely going to need a repeat. Okay, so four west, and then I went south once. Okay, so let's fill in some of the code. It's always good to test things out when working with a program, when working with code. All right, and then I need to go south again, pick some corn, south again, pick some corn. Ooh, this is getting long. I know I'm way over, but that's fine. We're just testing. Pick. Okay, and now I'm turning. Pick. Oop, and I still need one more. What would I have to do? I'd have to go south and pick. All right, let's take a look at this. West pick. West pick. West pick. West pick. Hmm. South pick. South pick. Off pick, off pick. So, what am I doing here? West pick, west pick, west pick, west pick. I'm repeating myself. South pick, south pick, south pick. I'm repeating myself. Okay. Now you got to be careful with this because maybe you're like, okay, well I'm repeating myself. I'm doing it four times. Let me slap both these in here. That won't work because it's four different times. First, I do this four times. Then I do that four times. So, let's take our repeat, put in west and pick, and get rid of these. How many times do I do it? Well, we just said we do that four times. Now, I'm going to throw a south on this because I want you to see. Once it runs this four times, I'm going to go west. I'm going to pick. I'm going to go west. I'm going to pick. I'm going to go west. I'm going to pick. Okay, so now it's gone through four times. Oh, no, it hasn't. Now it's gone through four west. <laughs> And pick, that's my fourth time through. So what happens now? It hits this bottom and says, I've done it four times, and drops into the code below. However, what we would need to do is go south and pick one, two, three, four times. So why repeat ourselves again? We can just connect up all of this. And we said four. And look, we're at seven blocks. Let's test it out. Instead of what were we at before, 12 or 13? Go, go, go. And you can watch the loops work. Woohoo! And we did it. Repeat blocks are really powerful. You use loops, you lose, use repeats all the time in programming. Whether you're doing this or building the next big video game in adult life, really you do. So this is really powerful, powerful stuff. Let's keep going.